just seeing the inside of things of life in the video gaming world that's all that was actually pretty damn good and in grass life son of a moving like the speed of sound what is going on guys this is bullet range d and welcome back to the channel to another video of forza i know you guys don't really want to watch forza anyway but this video was saying thank you to a good friend of mine who made this in a sex Honda type R tune. I will leave his channel in the description box down below for you guys to check out as well as um, this gamer tag is on here but I'm not sure if he wants me to reveal that but as far as that goes I'm going to say big thank you for giving me this tune and I told him about this car. I'm going to be doing one video all week long for at least each day so I'm just kind of summing down on the cons for myself because I just I just feel like it's so I, as I need to. But anyway, all my links are down below as well as the channel I mentioned. Easy's channel will be in the description box down below for you guys to check out. So check him out. And this is the Honda NSX that he specifically tuned for me. And still needs a little bit more work done on it, but I appreciate it for what it is. It's not a Gran Turismo tune, mind you, but it's something and it still works. I figure I find a red, a red Bull paint job because this thing is quick, it has a twin turbo built into it and there's so much more I don't even know about what's inside the hood of this car. But it's very quick and it's pretty balanced for the weight. The, the body to weight ratio if you know what I mean. But here it is, the Red Bull edition drift rage of Need for Speed Red Bull Honda NSX Type R. It's very, very, it's looking very promising. And we're, I'm actually still going to practice a little bit with this car. So bear with me because I feel as though I need to practice with this car a little bit more. And yeah, leave me your thoughts and comments down below on, you know, I guess the car in particular and the way it handles. And you, I'm pretty sure you guys like the NSX because this is the car. This is my favorite car. Duh. Yeah. Just a few practice runs and then possibly hop online. On this track because I can. So. It's a little bit twitchy. And then again, this is freaking... Forza. Or I'm just a very bad driver, but who knows, right? This NSX is pretty dope, though. I like it. I just gotta have good control over the car. It is high off the ground, for one. Two, it's very fast. Three, this isn't my tune. So. Practicing with it for right now, a little bit more. I'm gonna be rusty on this game because this is simulation. Playing this game is a whole different ball game than Grand Turismo 6. I will keep you guys uploaded on the HDMI splitter, but we'll get into that later. This week coming up. That was actually a pretty good reverse entry, but it wasn't that clean. I'm impressed with it, at least. Alright, I'm gonna go around one more lap. Not bad, not bad. Trying to get more used to it. Definitely, definitely starting to work a little bit more. Nice. I didn't even say anything, it just recorded, I guess. 
and again it's Xbox and records anything. You don't even tell it to. Am I getting better at drifting on here? Maybe. I just gotta practice more and get into the groove. And before I was a drifter on these type of games, I was always a racer. So, big thank you to Easy for giving me this tune. I really appreciate the support and, you know, really helped me out because I'm not really the best when it comes to tunes. Judge me if you want to. Uh, it's a video game. They're meant to have fun. And sometimes there's stupid people online who would, you know, crash into you constantly because they don't know how to drive on this game knowing that, you know, the race vibes are shit. That's just my opinion. So, this car seems to handle fairly well. I am happy with the tune. Oh my god, wow, okay. So yeah, I'm very happy with the tune. It's uh, I just gotta get the handle a little bit more. I think it's been messed with earlier, I don't know. But I'm very satisfied for what this car is. And it definitely, definitely, definitely brings a light in the channel, so... Uh, big thank you, Easy, for letting me, you know, really drift the car that you made. And I appreciate your time. And that means a lot, dude. And it does look pretty damn nice with this Red Bull freaking paint job, paint skin. Looks really good. It does. It looks really, really good. So we're going to jump on the online lobby and drift, hopefully. This car looks pretty damn good though. No lie, it does. It looks pretty damn good for the paint job. Oh. Wow, Forza, you're completing other shit right now. So, finally we entered a lobby that actually works. And I'm going to make a rant video about Forza. I really am. It's coming soon. I can promise you that. This week. Um, I don't know how long the rant video was going to be, but I'm going to make a, a big deal out of it because for the simple fact is, I hope Forza Motorsport 7, okay, I hope that they don't make shit complicated and stupid the way they got this stuff set up. And I'm going to give up my thoughts and my opinions on the next Forza video. If you guys want to see that, if you, will, if you don't want to like this video, I greatly appreciate that too, it doesn't matter to me. At this point because, well, everyone's opinionated and everyone doesn't like it. Because you can't put opinions on the internet. It's good because everyone's different. And it was like, oh, you can't do opinion on Forza because uh, fanboys come in ahead. Watch out. Trying to really control this thing. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> really? I saw you spun out, jerk. Maybe your ass shouldn't be drifting. I don't know, like I said, probably the people on Forza, I swear they are a block of morons. I, I'm, it's the truth. Forza right now, they are a block of morons. They need to learn how to drift. No one's perfect, yes, but when it comes to it, it gets annoying. So I hope everyone gets better at drifting and driving. And myself so to speak but at this point Forza lobbies are a complete another shit they really are pretty much every single lobby I walk into 
They're shit. You guys are my thoughts, you can hear them right now. I'm sure most of you don't agree with me, that's totally fine. And look at that. Yeah. This drift build is good though. I like it. Son of a Yeah, I do I do really like this drift right now. I just gotta learn to get used to it a lot more, that's all. That was expected. So if it wasn't for this twin turbo. I would not be getting as much wheel spin and getting out of these turns as quick as I can. Which is good for the, you know, good for the car. And for the weight that it is, you know. That's what I'm thinking about, like. Is a 10 turbo really good for the car? Yes, but. Fan of really very powerful cars. When I'm drifting, I kind of like the mid-range of being low. When it comes to horsepower and drifting. That's just me. Because that's, that's what I'm comfortable with. I mean, everyone's different for their comfortability for their vehicle. Their favorite vehicle that they want to use. I can admit that I'm sitting on this game, but I overshot that turn. At least I'm not hitting anybody, though. I'm trying not to hit anybody. You guys can give me that, though. See? That wasn't intentional. These cars feel like freaking ice, man. Forza Motorsport 6 is a whole different ball game now. Where I get better at the drifting in due time? Yes, I will. I just need more time to play the game. Which I really don't put in time into to play this game anyway. So I'm not entitled to this game. Everyone's playing Forza. No one's really playing GT Sport, uh, GT6. Why? Because Forza is pretty much outdo. People say GT6 is dead. Not being a fanboy, just putting out the obvious. But a game that's old is not dead. Just people don't really want to play it anymore because they don't enjoy it. Just when some people don't even learn and even to top it off, think about. Who knows, I might be wrong, because my opinions suck, and no one's going to agree, but agree to disagree, right? Yep, that's it. Just agree to disagree. And it's good that we're not all thinking the same, because it would be, this world would be a very shit place, and very... Thinking differently is good, but I don't know. Just seeing the inside of things of life. In the video gaming world, that's all. That was actually pretty damn good. And then Grass Life. Son of a... It's all good, I can promise you that. Practice makes perfect, right? That's all, that's all it takes. In time, because I'm not putting any more... Really a lot of time into this game, anyway. At least I can hold it a little bit. A little bit reverse entry back there and someone's driving the Hot Wheels car.
This is Bullet Run HD, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video of Forza Motorsport 6. What a great build. This thing is worth, uh, definitely worth my time. And, um, yeah, I'm thankful for this build. Big thank you for building this car for me. I really appreciate it, Easy. Because that's the channel that I'm familiar with. And comments pretty much, not all the time, but he's there and he comments and i really appreciate his support as well as so everyone else is okay being honest here and um guys you guys are awesome i am done playing forza for the day that is it i'm gonna make a rant video this week so stay tuned for that and don't worry grand tourism will get a rant too because gotta make the things even uh anyway we're moving like the speed of sound all my links are down below as well as the youtube channel easies and uh, if you guys not new Hit that like button if you enjoyed. If you don't like me, that's totally fine. It's your choice. You don't have to like me. You don't have to be here if you don't want to to watch this video and any other of my videos that I posted. I don't force you to watch anything. If you take the time out of your day, subscribe, hit that like button. And if you don't like it, like I said, I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Thanks for coming.